Hey guys, Rachel here. So, I decided to make a video before transferring into the new studio, which is just my old bedroom, just cleaned up more. <sighs> so, yeah. Here it is. We're going to be talking about anxiety. Hooray. So, anxiety has to be one of the biggest challenges besides depression depression for me we'll see i i'm not sure about any of your anxiety attacks if you even do have anxiety at all so yeah like i'm just going to tell you about my anxiety attacks <laughs> like i remember my first one being when i was when everyone else in the classroom went to lunch and we'll see I learned that my real dad wasn't my legal dad, so I was, like, wondering about everything else, like, what is actually real. And then my teacher held me behind class, and then she was like, Rachel, why aren't you successing in week, in this week? And I was like, I don't know. And then she started yelling at me, I guess. I started crying. I fell apart. <laughs> so, yeah, that happened. <laughs> Then the second time was actually before my birthday, before I turned 13, and also when I exactly got these with a glasses chain. And my grandpa said that I could not take off the glasses chain for at least a month until I got used to having these. See, I got so used to it, I just pointed to my eye. <laughs> but yeah. So my dad texted me. It was actually a day when I got, like, really sick from the fair. It really upset me, actually. Um, and I said, hey, look, I don't want to go to the fair or over to the, um, or over to this concert. And you're like, wait, what's the concert about? It was a heavy metal concert. We got VIP tickets. And we were going to be in mosh pits. And we'll see, I had the glasses chain on, and I was told I could not take that off. Also, the very next day was a school day, and I felt sick. So it really upset me. It just made me really sad. And then he just blew up in my face about it, and that's when I had my second anxiety attack. <sighs> And then I had to, and then I came out to my grandpa, actually crying, and I asked him, am I a bad person? It really upset me. And also, he said that those tickets were my birthday present. I told him that he could just sell my ticket to someone, because I knew that he didn't have enough money for himself. That he needed it to you know, pay for the hotel room that he was living in instead of saving up money for a nice, simple, clean apartment. But yeah, so he's just like, he wasn't saving up money at all. Also, he didn't pay child support. He actually didn't. He still isn't. But yeah, he made me feel really horrible about myself, so I powered off my throne. I ac actually threw it because I was so upset. And then that night, to cheer me up, my family took me to karaoke. <clears throat> okay, so the third one is actually from yesterday, and this will wrap up the to the end of the video. So what it was is... <laughs> Um, I thought we were driving down the road to Halloween of Horror Nights. Well, I mean Universal. That's actually where me and my dad had our first ever conflict. Because I went on an X-rated site. So, um, <laughs> I thought that was it. So I started, you know, doing all the things that were normal before I had an anxiety attack. You know, just like snapping my fingers, um... I also brought along a stress toy because I knew I was going to be stressed about this thing that was currently going on in my life. So yeah, it really upset me. And see, it looked as though we were heading towards Orlando. So 
So I started freaking out in the back of the car. Um, and my mama didn't bring along her dog. Whenever I have an anxiety attack, I either use a stress toy, um, you know, or I read a book, or I pet a dog or a cat. But all I had was my stress toy, and it wasn't actually really helping me at the time. And my mama didn't bring along her small dog. So I didn't have much to deal with. So yeah. And also, um, tomorrow I have to go to a child and, like, child, um, um, I forget what it's called, um, Child Support Enforcement Office. And that really scares me because... Well, whenever I have to hear about my name close to my dad's name, it freaks me out and gives me, you know, anxiety. Like, it could send me into an anxiety attack. <laughs> so, yeah, I almost had a miniature-sized one tonight because I don't know what it was. I just started shaking. <laughs> Or it could just be from when I put my hand over a boiling pot of water for, like, to stir some noodles. Either way, I just started shaking. So, yeah. Talk to you guys later. Bye!